Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4. So, um, finally I actually got to play this game as much as I wanted last night and I did stay up pretty late playing it last night um, on my current household. So hopefully I'll actually have a current household up here soon. Again, I don't want to just put one up with nothing going on, so, you know. But anyways, um, loaded the game and here they are in this little garden area, which is cutie cutie i don't know what they're doing exactly but they're here they're ready to go all right let's see what we can do these are cute i love them all right so where's their house which direction is it this one? Ooh, feeling flirty what is this their house go home okay <laughs> This is the only thing that is kind of weird to me is how they can't, um, like, why they need a loading screen to go home. I mean, I could have just, like, told them to walk there, you know, and it would have worked, but this is also an option, I suppose. It just seems a little unnecessary for, like, that particular thing, you know. Anyways, though, let's go, um, water her plants. They just need to be watered desperately. They're dying of thirst. And they are feeling a flirty, flirty. Uh. And you guys are like, oh, please have babies, please have babies. And I'm like, guys, I will. <laughs> of course I'm going to have babies. Uh. It's like you don't know me at all. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but of course, that's like number one priority for me. Uh. Who's he talking to? Oh. <laughs> Being all flirty. Oh, he's talking to some uh, interesting people. What? Well, just come, just come back here. Come back here. <laughs> um, when does she start work? Two days. Okay, and his in twelve hours. So now that I've actually been playing, I do kind of understand everything a little bit. So, um, all right. Only a real neat freak would attempt to mop up a puddle on natural ground. I guess you got me there. Alright, so let's see what we can do today. Since she doesn't actually have to go to work. Practice writing for three hours. I guess she could go ahead and just like finish up that last hour. Maybe start writing a book or something so we can get some uh, money rolling here. And then what do you need to do? You are, okay, you're done. You are good to go. So you can do whatever the hell you want. What does he want to do? Schedule a date. Okay. Go for a jog and woohoo with Caitlin. Woo! Um, I'm gonna have you actually drink energy juice. I'm curious to see this. Yeah! Yeah! Now I'm super energized. Energized jog. Yep. Have fun. Have fun on your jog. And, um, is she done? Does it count the separate hour? I don't know. Let's fast forward here. I don't know if I have to, like, redo it. Oh! We leveled up! There we go. Now we got it. Coolness! Alrighty. She's gonna be a writer. So I'm definitely gonna have her write some books, um, very soon. Probably not quite yet. But how's her... Okay, her needs are super fine. So let's see where we can, we can go somewhere. Um, should we take him? Is he done with his jog? Yeah, he's already done. Wow. All right, you can come over here and um, you can learn to cook as well. Just come make some salad because then that way I'm not scared about you burning the house down. And you, let's go somewhere. Let's see what we can do. Let's go meet some people. Let's go travel. Because we need to go places. I love how big the phones are. <laughs> They're like bricks. Um, okay, let's see where we can go. Um... Did we go to the nightclub? Yeah, we did. We did. I wonder what the museum looks like. I haven't been to the museum at all. In my game either. Or that one. Um, I have been to this lounge. I really like this lounge. And um, I've been to this park. I, I'm not too huge on their park. I, I really like this one. Way, way, way more. Um, I want to visit the goths. But I don't know if they're home. Because every time I try to go, they're not home. I had to, like, 
play as the goths for me to see the goths. So. Yeah. I was like, come home. So is anyone here? Oh, yes. We're in. Check it out. Oh my god, their house, though. Alexander Goth? You're in this family? Uh, well, let's go introduce ourselves. You know. Let's meet some people. So, so. <laughs> I don't think she knows, like, What's anyone. Okay, let's discuss our favorite authors. <laughs> Maybe he's a bookworm. <laughs> He comes from a pretty, like, smart family, so maybe? <laughs> Anyone else here? Ooh. Cassandra and Mortimer. Interesting. Pretty sure Cassandra has her own bed over here. And then third floor. This must be, um... What's his name's room? I forgot his name. Uh... Oh, is this him? Is he a teenager? How would I be able to tell? Yeah, he is, because there's no romantic option. Oh, okay, guys, I've been playing for a while, <laughs> and I guess, I guess he aged up. All right, whatever. Let's ask about his day. I feel kind of awkward now. Now that I found out that he's a teenager, I feel like maybe I shouldn't be talking to him. Now I'm, uh, feeling a little awkward. To be honest. Alright, well, I'm done with this. So, you go home. <laughs> I didn't realize what the time was. It's like almost... Oh no, it is midnight. Okay. And, um, I don't know if you guys have seen when they go to sleep at night. The, like, time doesn't stay at that, like that third level of speed it actually goes to like a hyper speed when they sleep or when they're at work so like if you guys are thinking that it's really frustrating like the sims 2 whenever you have to wait for them to go to go to work when they're like you know because they leave the lot it's actually kind of perfectly okay because it goes into like this hyper speed i'll show you in just a second because um even though she's not really that sleepy i'm gonna have her go to sleep why is he feeling flirty he wants to woohoo with someone. Well, we can for show do that. Actually, let's not just jump right into it. I'm going to have him do, like, some sexy pose. Okay, let's do this. Let's hook her up with a sexy pose. Oh, she feeling it? Let's be enticing. Alright, what else can we do? Let's do a passionate kiss. Oh, that's that one from the preview. That one is so cute, though. Like, for real. Oh, whoops. Alright, now let's offer her a rose. Try for a baby? I don't know if we should yet. Should we try for a baby? Why not? Let's just do it. <laughs> it is under the woohoo category. Are they down? <laughs> I love how excited they get for this. Like, you guys are so weird. <laughs> I could have said something really bad right then. Okay, this is her sleepwear. I put her hair in a bun, and it plays this really nice, calming music. <laughs> I love how they're just watching. Nothing but smiles. And also, there's no longer, like, a jingle. Because that's how we would know if she was pregnant or not. I'm just going to speed through this. There we go. Um, now, actually, if you want to know if you're pregnant... You go to the toilet here and you can take pregnancy test. So let's see, um, let's see what happens if she goes and does it. And it costs fifteen dollars. Oh, Caitlyn is not pregnant. No. 
Take a cold shower. Okay, it's weird. Interesting. She wants to buy a toy just because she wants kids. Oh, I love how they just squeezed through that door at the same time. That was nice. Um, okay, we're gonna do it again because that just does not satisfy me. Here, you can go ahead and get out of there. I love how they're so down. I also love how she can take a pregnancy test like instantly. Because <laughs> then I don't have to wait. Okay, we're just gonna fast forward through this. We've already seen how it goes. And go do it again. No, I was like, go do it! Now, let's see. Yay! Yes! Already not feeling too great. Eating for two. Congratulations, Caitlin is expecting. There is going to be a new addition to this household. Oh, hells yeah. Um, usually I would not just jump right into it like this, but... You know. Is she already, like... Okay, and it goes by um, trimester, which um, it kind of reminds me of The Sims 2 a little bit. Um, the way that it's, like, so singled out. In The Sims 3, like, the way that her belly grew and everything, it was kind of gradual. But in here, I feel like it's more, um, like, straightforward, like, right when she gets out of bed and stuff. So right here it says, um, It is thrilling to discover a life growing inside you. And uh, it says pregnant. Second trimester in 24 hours. So I'm like, does she already look pregnant? I wouldn't think so. She is still flirty, though. Alright, let's see. She needs to take a shower, actually. So, I'm just gonna have you take a regular shower. I don't want you to do anything crazy. Is he, is he really drinking that? On the toilet? <laughs> I've actually seen some of my sims do that. They will, like, continue eating their food or drinking their drink while they're, like, peeing. And I'm like, um... <laughs> okay. <laughs> he wants to do some sit-ups. Do them. You come do your sit-ups. I think that's so funny. When they're energized, they can just like work out anywhere. That cracks me up. That cracks me up. Okay, hold on. So now it is 5 in the morning. We have wasted so much time. Oh, he has to go to work very soon. I'm just going to have him go ahead and go to sleep. Um, just so he can have a little bit more energy. And her as well. Just to kind of get through the day. And see now if it'll... Oh, okay. You see the time down here? It's going into, like, hyper speed. It's like something you can't even, like, choose. It goes into super mega... Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. I didn't realize he would sleep that much. No! You better get to work. Oops. That was a my bad. <laughs> and now it's going into hyper speed again because he's at work and she's there. Okay, so it says, hack it. While performing a routine background check, Cameron runs into an ex unexpected firewall. He didn't think the information he needed was going to be protected. He can either hack through the firewall to dig deeper or call in the senior agent for help. Um, I, what, what would I do? Let's see. I would probably call in somebody. Ah. Senior agents can't come running into the, mm -hmm. hold on. I can't come running into to the rescue every time. You've got to start taking more initiatives as Cameron's boss. Oh, great. I did the wrong thing, of course. All right, but I'm going to have her come cook some stuff so she can get that cooking skill up, which she already has. So now we can make a couple of other things, which is cute. Let's go make some, um, hmm, let's make some chips and salsa because, like, yum, honestly. Let's see how she's looking. Any bigger? A little bit, yeah. So now she's having morning sickness, and um, these are just all the joys of a pregnancy. But um, I did try to change her hair for each outfit, because I thought it would be a little bit more realistic. So like when she goes to sleep, I have it in a bun, and like when she's formal, I have it up in like a high, like fancy bun. I'm gonna fast forward through this. Chips and salsa. I love how it's actually like the correct food. It like shows the right thing. 
Oh, and also another thing, when they're pregnant, they have to pee constantly, which is realistic because that's what happens to pregnant people. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to have her eat that, and then I'm going to put this up for you. And I, can I clean this up, or does she have to do it? No, no, I guess she has to do it. I'll have her clean that up after she's done. She is just feeling all sorts of bad. Alright, and then come use the restroom before you pee yourself. Alrighty. And I don't know if they have maternity leave in this game. I don't think they do, to be honest. Which is nice. Which is super nice. She is feeling so uncomfortable. Poor thing. My other sim that I have in my current household, when she got pregnant, she actually didn't feel uncomfortable at all. Which is, like, weird to me because I was expecting it to be, like, super bad. And also, there are no maternity clothes. Your sim will show their belly through whatever they were wearing before. So, here's little pregnant Caitlyn in her everyday wear. And I'm going to have her tend to these plants, actually. Yay! We're feeling better. And let's water some of these. Can anything be harvested yet? I don't think so. And also, another thing you can do with the plants is once um, once they're so taken care of, you can actually evolve them, and then they'll be worth more when you harvest them. It's pretty nice. I've been doing this a lot. Ooh, he's feeling super grungy, so let's, let's have him take a shower. And what does he have to do now? Same thing? Just browse intelligence. Okay. So this right here, I guess the daily task helps him um, advance in this. And then also you can't, you cannot advance unless you finish the little tasks you're supposed to do. And sometimes it actually can get really challenging. That's what I've noticed. Watch sports on a TV. You can totes do that. Make yourself a little happier. While she gardens out here. Little pregnant gardener. How cute are you? I am, like, really, like, excited for the babies, though. Because I feel like it'll definitely make... Or give us a bit of a challenge. Who are you? I don't know. Let's go introduce ourselves. I feel like she definitely needs a girlfriend. You know? And she leveled up. Sweet. Ah. Oh, Hello, <laughs> Judith. Interesting outfit. Let's give her a heartfelt compliment since we're all feeling very happy. Let's tell her a funny story. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. We have to tell Cameron that we're pregnant, if you can't already tell. Let's share. It's called Share Big News. So, oh, dang it. Sorry, Judith, but we have things to do. Come on. Stop talking to Judith. <laughs> Pee like a champion. <laughs> nice. Let's see what happens when she tells him. Did she tell him? Does he know? That's so weird. When I did it the other time, it was like really exciting for some reason. Whatever. What the? <laughs> what are you doing in our house? <laughs> but he has to pee really bad. And I like when they're confident, it says pee like a champion. What else? Would it say anything else? What can he do whenever he's energized? I guess nothing? I don't know. I don't know. Propose crazy scheme to someone. Where are you going, boo boo? Their needs are, like, all over the place when they're pregnant. I can't even keep up. I'm gonna put this up. Where did that cup go? Oh. <laughs> it went back. Let's put it in the sink. That'll clean it up. Um, I guess... Let's tell her an unbelievable story. Okay. I'm just, like, so waiting for the baby. Like, that's, like, mostly what it is. And I think what I'm going to do is have her um, start writing a novel. Look, they're playing The Sims! The Sims 1! 
That is amazing. Thank you, Timer. But that's so cute! Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna have her start writing um, a children's book. Name the book. Um, okay, let's name the book. Never Eat Your Pet Turtle and Other. What can we name this book? How did I just randomize it? I don't... How did I... I guess it gives you two? I don't know, that was weird. <laughs> what should we name the book? It's a children's book. Let's name it... The Moon... No, let's name it The Happy... What is that thing? Um, the cow in The Sims... What is it? It's a cow plant. I'm gonna name it The Happy Cow Plant because I'm lame. How would you describe this book? He is very happy. Too happy. <laughs> I'm so lame. That was like the lamest name ever. That was so lame. <laughs> well, anyways, um, another thing that I really like is that when they write novels, it does not take that long. It really doesn't. Down here, it'll show you. There's like a green circle that goes around the action here. Oops, I just like hit my mic. And um, it really doesn't take that long if you like speed it up. You know, it doesn't take like three days like it used to. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up here. I'm sorry that the nothing is really happening quite yet. I am waiting for the baby to kind of spice up things a little bit here. But um, I do want them to advance in their careers because it is a little challenging to make money in this game. So um, I would definitely want to get a kickstart on that so that we can... um get some moolah. I might get like an easel and stuff like that. I know it's an old-fashioned way to make money, but guys, it works. It really does, and it still works in this game. But it's a little more challenging because you have to pay to paint, which makes sense because in reality, you would have to pay to paint. You have to buy paint and paintbrushes, and it actually makes a whole lot of sense. So you have to pay so much money, and then you may or may not make a profit by the time you're done with that painting. So kind of interesting the way that it works. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye everyone.